Hello and welcome to Zabbix Handy Tips. Today we will be covering user roles. To edit user roles you must have a super administrator type role with sufficient permissions. Go to the administration user roles menu section and press create user role. Enter the role name. I'll call mine cluster admin. Then select required user type. In my case it's admin. By default, all administrator level rights are granted, but we are going to revoke some of them. I don't want my cluster admins to have access to the actions and discovery menu sections, but they will still be able to edit hosts, host groups, and templates. Let's also remove default access to new UI elements. Now, if a new section is added to Zabbix menu in later versions, access will not be granted automatically during an upgrade. Next, let's move to the API. We can create a deny list to restrict only specific methods or an allow list to allow only listed API methods. I'll do the latter and allow only methods related to host configuration. Note that the API method field supports auto completion, suggesting suitable methods as I type. In the actions block, I want to revoke the rights to change problem severity, close problems, manage API tokens and execute scripts. And done, the role is configured. Press add to save it, and we can see that the new cluster admin role has appeared in the user role list. Now you can go ahead and assign it to your users.